Hey guys, welcome to another video on Bharat in Germany. My name is Bharat and in this video I want to talk about how do you immigrate to Germany because this is a very like vague question that many people ask. So essentially immigration can happen in three broad like scenarios. The first one is a student visa. So it doesn't matter if you come for a student visa for your bachelor's, student visa for your master's, student visa for your MBA program. From all of these three, you're able to get the 18 months stay back time or the job searching time where you're able to find different kind of jobs after your master's, bachelor's or MBA is done. Now, why I'm like considering MBA and master's separately because MBA programs are generally just for one year, whereas master's program, they're generally from 1.5 to two years. But still for all of them, the stay back time is still 18 months. So this is one thing that you can take a look at. The second thing I can tell you is you can think about coming to Germany for a job seeker visa and then think about finding a job. I really recommend this in the cases where like you have some kind of like decent German proficiency and you have good work experience because when you're making this big step of quitting your current job, moving to a new country and then looking for a job there, you have a lot at stake. And this is something that you have to keep in mind because this can also mess with your head. And then afterwards, maybe you do not feel as confident as you would have otherwise because you know, if you do not get this specific job, if you do not get this specific position, you will have to return back. So this I really recommend only when you have already looked for jobs from India or like wherever country you're coming from, like do it for like at least two to three months, take a look at all of the job portals, apply to different kinds of companies, and then come here and then start following up again, start looking for jobs, start contacting different kinds of offices. That makes the most sense because otherwise I think you'll be wasting a lot of time. The third thing is directly coming on the employment visa. This is something you can do when you have already found a job in Germany directly from your home country, then they will pretty much sign the contract with you. With that contract, you're able to easily apply for the visa at your local embassy or consulate. And then pretty much you come to Germany and you start living here. Now, if you think about the entire immigration process, like getting the permanent residency can take up to five years for some people. And in other cases, it can just take up to 21 months. 21 months is the case for blue card. Five months is the standard case when you haven't done any kind of studies in Germany and you also do not have any kind of blue card and stuff, then generally it takes five years. Now the citizenship side of the things that can take again anywhere from five years to eight years. But for example, if you are coming to Germany for your studies, in two years, you're able to get your permanent residency. Then after three years, once you have paid your social contributions for five years or 60 months, you're able to apply for the citizenship. So there are a lot of different kinds of rules and regulations that you have to keep in mind. But I do think that it is like really much simpler actually to come to Germany and like immigrate here than like sometimes like for Canada and stuff because I can only tell you from the experience of my brother right now. He has applied for his permanent residency in Canada last year. And he's still telling me that it is going to take at least the end of this year or the starting of next year for him to receive his permanent residency. And because of that, he cannot start his bachelor's because if you do your studies in Canada without having a PR, you are paying a lot more money in fees than you would be paying otherwise when you have the permanent residency. So that's why for like financial reasons, like he's waiting up for that. And it just doesn't make sense. Like how can just like giving out a permanent residency like take one and a half years? In Germany, when you apply for the permanent residency, it comes back to you within one month. That's it. You have it. And I find it so much simpler. So that's pretty much it from my side. If you have any kind of questions whatsoever, you can write it down in the comment section below. If you want to sit down for a one-on-one -on -one appointment, you can book that with the link given in the description. And I'll see you there. Bye.